that's about as close as I can get it, everybody. So I just threw a capo on one. What you want to do is we're going to start out with a, uh, an, it's kind of like an A sus, basically, is what we got. So we're uh, capo one, A sus, so I'm barring across uh, D, G, and B in the second fret, and I'm setting my middle finger down on the third fret of the B. And I'm going to plug A. So I'm assigning my index, middle, and ring finger to the G, the B, and the high E in this song. So my thumb's going to plug A, index, and middle are going to plug uh, G and B. Then I'm going to hammer down my pinky onto, uh, what is that, from the capo, that's uh, fifth fret of the B. So we're going and we're plucking that, uh, that second fret of the D. Then we're plucking B by itself. Then G. Alright. One more time. B and hammer again onto that fifth fret. All right. Now we're going to do the riff. So we've got. So what that is, is plucking. You're setting your ring finger on fourth fret from the capo. Plucking and sliding down to third fret and then pulling off to first fret. So from the riff. It's kind of weird, but once you get it quick, I think it sounds pretty accurate. And then once you get there, first fret of the B, you're going to pluck again and then set your middle finger down on 2nd fret of the G. Now that's going to set you up for the next chord, which is going to be an F major 7. So for this F major 7, I'm taking my thumb over the top on 1st fret and then adding ring finger down here on the 3rd fret of the D. So see that shape? So now once you get there, so you just did your... Um, Did the now you're gonna go yeah that's what it is so you're doing E D G E G then when you come back you're gonna do a hammer on that second fret of the G So all that now we go to the C add nine shape so you're gonna set your middle finger down here third fret of A ring third fret of B pinky third fret of high E you're gonna go so you're just going thumb on A ring on high E and that's G B G so you got then again A and high E. Then you're going to reach your pinky up to 5th fret. All the way down here to 1st fret of B. So you got so Once you get there, to that first fret of the B, you're going to set your middle finger down on the second fret of the D, ring finger, third fret of the low E. And we've got a riff that goes... So that's thumb on low E, middle finger on B, thumb jumps down to D. just B, G, then you let off, 
and do the same thing. So you've got... All right. Now the second time through, pretty much everything's the same. Except right here, we're going to go to a regular C and go... So that's just A, D, B, G. Then A, D, B. And then that's a real simple G. You just jump your ring finger up to third fret of low E, plug E and B together simultaneously. So you've got... So let's play it all real slow. So we've got Alright, so I hope this lesson was helpful for you. Go ahead, hit the like and subscribe button, and I'll see you on the next video.